Hello everyone, welcome back to Sleep Talk. My name is Rachel. Um, first, I just want to say, if you're liking my vids, please subscribe and share and I'll keep making more of them. Um, you can also follow me on Instagram, at Sleep Talk PJs, and we can chit chat about jam jams um, on that platform as well. And definitely comment. Uh, I want to hear your thoughts, opinions, and we can just kind of talk on a little YouTube action here as well. All right, so on tonight's agenda, um, we're going to cover BST, flippers. Um, I'm actually going to do a fun little unboxing video of my latest haul of Little Sleepies. I've been on a tear, um, and some of what is in these packages is going to surprise even me, to be honest. Um, and then I want to let you in on an awesome little secret I found. There is a um, little boutique online running a 25% discount site-wide and they got a lot of little sleepies. They've got two pieces, gowns, mama jams, shorties, bows, hats, you name it, and they're running sales so they're doing discount, 25 discount on top of the sales and it's wild and I scored some major deals. Um, when I placed my order with their website last week, got in all my product, um, looks good, no holes, anything like that. It's totally, totally legit. And I'm not affiliated with them at all. I don't even know anyone there, but they were fast. They left a little cute note, um, in my package. So definitely recommend that. So keep watching if you're interested and I know you are. So, um, very excited to share that with you as well. So first up buy, sell, trade. How did I even become involved with this? Um, it was kind of an accident. I was buying more little sleepies and I joined the VIP group and I saw people posting pictures of these prints I'd never seen before. I was like, dinosaurs, want that. Strawberries, sunflowers, what? Gotta have those. So I was Googling, I was like, Mercari, Poshmark, what's happening here? Um, and then I just went on the Facebook search bar and you know, typed in Little Sleepies, and the first one that popped up was a group called Little Sleepies Anonymous, and I thought, like, I had no idea it was a BST group. I just saw, like, that's me. Um, might have a problem, so I, I just thought maybe it was, like, a platform for pajama enthusiasts, and there are some, like, kind of, you know, back and forth stuff in there, but it is largely a buy-sell trade community, and whoa, I was like, a kid in a candy store and it's addicting uh, do some donned action like who's gonna have the highest bid boom 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 and everyone's going at it and some of them some of these prints man you get in there like anything like navy puppies it's like a bloodbath um, and actually today in another buy sell trade group I saw someone put up a navy puppies swaddle and I thought to myself oh shit here we go. She put, that mama put 350 was her deal, you know, and then people could bid and try to get up to like whatever else. Someone offered 350 right off the bat and she took it. That is probably the highest price sale of literally anything I've ever seen. So that was bananas and I loved it. Um, but wow. Uh, I, I really, I was looking forward to actually kind of seeing the action on that one, but it was, it was over before I even started. So anyway, back to me joining the BST group, ended up joining some more. And so like, I've been wheeling and dealing left and right. Um, actually mostly wheeling, not dealing. I haven't, um, sold any pajamas yet, but I'm thinking about it probably will. Um, it's so hard to let go. Um, but I've scored a lot of hard to find prints, snagged all my dissos, and on top of it, I've been having a great time because it is full of tea, ladies. Woo! I mean, the drama is real. And the biggest thing kind of happening right now that wasn't so much happening in the fall, it was more after the new year, is there's been a lot of pushback in the community of flippers. So what a flipper does is they go to the website on drop day, 
buy a, buy up a bunch of the hot shit and then turn around and sell it um after it sells out so um you know kind of like a little mama business side hustle there like i can respect the game but a lot of people do not respect the game there was uh, someone who flipped the very first drop which was the watercolor hearts and forever friends or whatever and they had some uh cloud blankets up there they had some swaddles and she was listening them for like not even like crazy maybe like 20 to 30 dollars over retail it was practically a riot there was like over 700 comments mama's going back and forth like going to bat for each other like flipping is wrong like make that money mama and it was wildly entertaining and even just this morning i mean like i said i've been seeing it all over the place in a lot of groups and most of these groups have rules that you can't do price commenting so it's very interesting to see a lot of people risk getting muted or booted and not being able to buy or sell um, because they feel so passionately one way or the other but in even this but even this morning um, I'm part of like a little sleepy's rant page and I guess even we all ranted too hard because that thread got deleted but essentially it was on the same topic and my position is largely like you know it's a free market and you know if someone's willing to pay for it and you can sell it at that price like why not make that money um i know it kind of puts a, a little bit of a hardship on folks who maybe can't afford it at that price but there's a lot of really cute prints um on the website currently and one's coming out like all the time that you can definitely snag and i've noticed little sleepies has definitely been up in their stock lately so i don't feel like you know for the most part folks are getting left out but my but aside from all of that my biggest point is this is amazing what a time to be alive i was talking to my friend and her kids are older they're like i don't know 12 15 something like that and she's like i would have killed for an opportunity to sell my kids used pajamas at what I paid them for or more? Are you kidding me? We are living the dream, people. We are buying clothes for our kids and then selling used pajamas for more than we paid for them. What? I don't think anyone should be com complaining about this. I mean, we all have the opportunity to make money. If I can buy my kids some clothes, wear them, and resell them and essentially either break even or make money and buy more pajamas down the road like why not i think we should encourage this this is great and you know what everyone has the opportunity to make money because they're releasing new prints all the time you can buy them use them up sell them later i think it's fantastic and that's just how i feel about it i think it's very exciting and i look forward to making back or maybe making a little bit of money someday if i ever decide to you know bite the bullet and actually like sling some of this shit so anyway enough of that um but i do want to hear your opinion on it leave some in the comments i want to have this discussion i think it's i think this market is absolutely fascinating which is you know why i'm running this channel in the first place and like i said i haven't even sold anything so i've been you know a casual observer i guess not so casual because i have a channel i've been in enthusiastic interested observer and it's interesting for me to have a lively debate and kind of go back and forth and it's not malicious at all i really genuinely want to talk about it so anyway enough of that um let's get to a little bit of sleepy unpackaging because like i said i've been on a roll lately and let's see what we got i'm sure there's some fun stuff in here so in the interest of time saving i had my husband slice through the tops of the packages so you wouldn't have to see me like you know slice everything off it'd be boring um so like let's get to it what is in door number one now some of these are uh bst buys some of these are boutique buys and i'll tell you which is what oh oh so this is a bst buy and omg 
it is an OG. Look at her. Hello, gorgeous. Right out the gate. OG sunflowers. This is my favorite print. I just love sunflowers in general. They're just such a happy, pretty little flower and reminds me of sunshine and warmth and good vibes, you know? And I see this print, it's very, has a very vintage aesthetic and I'm very much into that. And I have a zippy, she's hanging up behind me, but I've been dying for a two piece. This is a little bit bigger than I would have ideally liked. It's a five, six. I kind of want a more like a two, three T, but I'm not complaining. She's here, she's in my arms and I can't wait to throw this on my girl. It's gonna be great. Woo, Woo. that was exciting. All right, up next, we have another BST purchase. What do we got here? Oh no, this isn't BST. This is a, this is a boutique. Um, not the one I was gonna tell you about that's running the discount. Um, this one is, oh, we've got a buffalo plaid gown, brand new, super cute doesn't have tags on it though oh shit no I lied has tags on it brand new beautiful condition and a new in bag koala, coral koala gown super cute I love gowns I think they're really underrated people don't talk about them very much but I mean when you have a newborn even up to like you know one two months old like gowns are the way to go like just tie them up pull them open, change that diaper. And I found it's actually really helpful when you're getting all those like new baby shots and their poor little thighs. And I just, you know, it's a little bit more roomy in there, especially if they swell up a little bit. So um, big fan of gowns. And I've actually seen other mamas turn them into little dresses, like sleep dresses, which I kind of want to try. That'd be really cute. So anyway, that's that. Uh, next up, this is a BST purchase, Sushi Crib Sheets. Now this is a print, I kind of want to do like an episode on this topic because I think it's really interesting. Um, I like sushi, actually me and my husband met at a sushi restaurant incidentally. And when I saw this print was coming out, I was like, oh my gosh, that looks, that looks really cute. Like I'm gonna get one. Didn't get any size ups or anything like that. And then I got it and I see it in person, it is, Oh, cute in person. I immediately got size up. And it's just one of those ones where you think like, oh, yeah, that's cute. Like I could get it. But then you get it in person. And you're like, oh, my God, this is too much. I have this little like, you know, sashimi with a little smiley face on it. Oh, my God. Love that. Love the crib sheets. Let's see. What else do we have here? This is, this is from a boutique. And... We've got, oh, a, we've got a jungle safari gown. That's cute. Jungle safari gown from a boutique. Oh, we've got lavender bunny zippies. Super cute also. And I guess I got two of them. Two lavender bunny zippies. This is, this is a really sweet print. Ugh. So, so cute. That's a good boutique find as well. All right, this one is, this is a Mercari store. So I offered her a deal on a bundle of, are you ready? Aqua puppies. Aqua puppies are hot right now. And I can definitely understand why. These little hot dogs super cute plus i love the color this aqua mint color is everything i love it all right next we've got this one is a bst score look at this another og strawberry zippy what is this 18 and 24 months super cute this one was listed as vguc i think or euc i'll have to double check my notes 
Um, it's, it's beautiful. The tag's not worn out or anything. Awesome. All right, moving on. We've got this one. I think this is Mercari. This is a new in bag blue green dinosaur zippy. Holy shit. I have definitely outdone myself. We've got OG strawberries, OG sunflowers. We've got a jungle safari gown. We have dinosaurs. Whew. This is fun. I'm having a good time. It's like Christmas, but better. Because my, <laughs> it's like Christmas minus that ugly shirt my husband got me. I know, I'm sorry. I know you're gonna watch this, but it was, it was something, ladies. It was something. All right, this is a BST purchase. I've got a teal bee lovey. Now, lovey's, my girl is not that into them right now. She has a few, but I just think they're really cute. So here we go. Teal bee lovey. All right, and then now I have actual little sleepy sport. Oh wait, no, I have one more. One more boutique buy. Bah, 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 bah. Now, I have spent a significant amount of time. Like I said, my daughter goes to bed at like seven, so. And I'm a little bit of an insomniac. So I have a lot of time on my hands at night and I've been through a lot of shows. I've watched everything from like Yellowstone to Emily in Paris. Um, definitely Team Gabriel, by the way. Um, but I have compiled a list of well over a hundred boutiques that sling little sleepies and I'm going to share one with you tonight, but I thought maybe, um, every week I would share with you another boutique that has great buys and discounts and stuff like that, because I want to share the wealth. Oh, okay. So we have lavender bunnies in two pieces. Super cute. And we have... Oh, gray kisses, gray kiss gown, and oh, two gray kisses gown. Look at that. Little besos, super cute. All right, and now I actually can get into my actual little sleepy purchases. Let's see what we got here. Oh, finally, it's my uh, V-Day drop, and we have Dun, 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 dun. Blue crib sheets. It's a show game. <laughs> they don't exist. <laughs> All right, we have swaddles. Look at those. Those are super cute. Actually, I was thinking to myself, like, this is probably like one of the cutest, more original prints they've done in a while. Is the Forever Friends? When I saw it, I was like. That's different from what they usually do. Um, you know, like the flowers and stuff like that. And super sweet. And I got my girl, got my girl Zippy for V-Day. Super excited to see her in that. All right, we also got Lovies. Gray dog lovey, pink dog lovey. Um, these are the ones, like I said last week, my husband was on lovey duty. He definitely came through, probably overdid it. We got a lot of loveys here. Um, that's, that's awesome. All right, so, yep, no blue crib sheets, but I do have pink. Um, when they did the sneak peek of this drop, like the first thing, the only thing I really, really wanted was these watercolor crib sheets. I just thought they're just so beautiful and you can use them year round too. Like not just, obviously you would use them year round. That'd be crazy to only use Valentine's Day prints in February, but you know what I mean? Like they're more like everyday sheets all the time. Sheets. Oh. And we also got pink watercolor swallows because that's damn cute as well. So quite a haul, super fun. Um, let me know what your sleepy haul or stash looks like. Um, I want to talk about it. Some of your favorites, what you're disappointed in, um, what you're like overwhelmingly in love with. And yeah, oh, it was fun. 
Okay, after all of that, um, so I, as promised, I would let you know the boutique website that's having that major sale right now. It is called Tiny Trendsetters, and they are having a 25% off site-wide discount, and they have shit tons of little sleepies. You're going to go wild, mama. And like I said, some of them are on sale, and you double down on that discount. Um super exciting so get out there buy up them sleepies i like i said i'm unaffiliated with this shop it was just like a late night internet gold mine that i discovered and i want to share that with you so thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe share comment whatever um let me know your thoughts i look forward to seeing you all again in my next episode which will be whenever i do it a couple days all right, good night.